Hi friends in this video we are going to learn how to configure flexible work hour policy in cosec time and attendance module flexible work hour policy is available from cosec centra software version v9r3 let's start with the configuration first add user and set flexible attendance marking for the user go to users module and add the user go to t and a option followed by attendance and select attendance marking type as flexible instead of normal provide minimum working hours for full day as well as half day second assign shift schedule to the user third configure flexible working settings in cosec time and attendance module consider daily hours as first flexible for 24 hours for consideration of 24 hours second from shift starting time does not consider work before shift starting time third till shift ends does not consider work after shift ending time and fourth shift start to shift end does not consider work before or after shift start and end time respectively let's consider flexible for 24 hours in our case Grace for work hours can be provided in minutes from 1 to 999 
grace count can also be provided from 1 to 99. Users do not have to compensate these grace minutes for the day. For example, if daily work limit is 6 hours and grace time is 30 minutes, if the user works for just 5 hours 30 minutes, the system will still mark him present for the whole day. Select the flexible hour calculation either on the weekly basis or monthly basis. If you are selecting weekly basis, then select the start day of the week. Let's consider monthly basis. Check the box apply daily work limit if needed. This function will always check whether full day hours are completed or not and only then it will mark present despite the user fulfilling his target hours. Set monthly target hours. Let's choose 60 hours. You can also deduct hours from the target by enabling this function for week off, public holiday, leave and field break. Enabling this will deduct the respective hours from the monthly target hours which are mentioned in front of these holidays. For example, if there are two week offs in a month and four hours are mentioned as week off hours in deduct hours from target then the monthly target for the user will become 52 hours, that is 60 minus 8 hours. Shortfall hours reduction specifies the number of hours to be deducted as full day hours from the weekly or monthly target shortfall hours, if any. This parameter will determine how many half days in a week or month must be marked as absent if a user's weekly or monthly target is not met, even if the daily minimum hours requirement is met. Apply daily work limit is must for shortfall hours configuration. If you want to consider the work hours on leave, week off and public holiday, then check these boxes. Let's consider this example. Minimum work hours required for half day is 3. Minimum work hours required for full day is 6. Daily work limit unchecked. Monthly target 60 hours. Punches for the month are as under. Monthly target for 60 hours is completed. After monthly process, the updated status is as under. As monthly target is achieved, the system will mark present on all days of the month based on flexible work hour policy. Example 2 Minimum work hours required for half day is 3. Minimum work hours required for full day is 6. Daily work limit is checked. Weekly target 51 hours. Deduct hours from target for leave, week off, or public holiday is unchecked for all. Consider work hours for leave week off public holiday week off or public holiday is checked for all for shortfall hour deduction deduct full day hours is 6 hence deduction for half day hours is 6 divided by 2 that is 3 punches are as under
डे इज कंसिडर्ड ऑल वीकली वर्क आवर्स फोर्टी टू वीकली शॉर्ट फॉल आवर्स नाइन नंबर ऑफ हाफ डेज टू बी डिडक्टेड थ्री आफ्टर मंथली प्रोसेस अपडेटेड स्टेटस इज Thank you for watching this video. For further queries, please contact Matrix Technical Support team.